This is a video of stage one of reboxing an iMac. First, put it into target disk mode. <coughs> then transfer back onto your old Mac Mini. And wait. Welcome to a day two of the reboxing of a, an iMac. It's taking two days because I started late last night and it was too late to get the box out of the loft. Right, here we have the box. Um, you sort of unseal it again like I, I did last time uh, because I sealed it up last time. And there we go, nice shiny iMac box. It's lovely, nice, nice finish to the box. I suppose the first thing to probably do would be to. Uh, Take out the uh, the keyboard keyboard box. Probably the easiest thing to do. Make sure try and do things in some sort of order. Slide out the keyboard or the empty keyboard tray. You can see I'm one of those uh, annoying people that keeps absolutely every every bit of packaging from Apple. Um, oops, there's a badge. Don't really need that. So there we go, cloth there, right, there we go, as you see, a few minutes later and the uh, box is packaged back up, ready to go. If we attempt to do this one handed, nice, uh, nice design packaging, it allows you to uh, repackage the box uh, in one single hand movement. So right, next out of the box we shall... Uh, a little bit tight for a room up here, so not the biggest of rooms. <coughs> Next up, we have a uh, a big plastic cover for the uh, the outer cover of the Mac. And then we have um, don't quite know what this material is. It's almost like a sort of fiber paper type material, which actually covers the exterior of the iMac, uh, ready to be boxed back up. Next step. Carefully removing all the uh, cables. Spot printer, there's the um, something, USB, blah blah blah, firewire, and of course the, uh, oops, I spin my head, uh, the mains cable. Which I might be able to use the, the package. Uh, no, no, I was hoping to actually use the uh, iMac package in there to actually. Ah, there we go to hold the iPhone in place, but that's uh, not worked. Right, sorry about the pause then, I accidentally pressed the wrong button. Uh, I can actually then fold the edges down there, make it look quite nice, like neat and tidy. There we go, well, my fingers don't look very nice. Uh, there we go, that's, 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 that's quite good. Um, so we're going to try and get this down. A bit neater. There we go, move the fat finger again. As you can see, nice the nice sheath. Right, I should probably be able to do the next bit um, one handed. <coughs> we'll give it a try. Obviously, this is the protective uh, sheet that goes over the Mac. Let's move that. Uh, let's move my, uh, my empty cup of tea. Mm -hmm. Oops. Paperwork, blah blah blah, usual things. Right, so um, I think yes, I know which way this goes on. Obviously, I do remember the Apple uh, sort of seal was at the back of the unit, so it's um, oops, no, I didn't seal that down. Didn't seal that down. It's entirely. So I've probably got that. Probably got that upside down. I think. I don't think it matters, it's still sticky, it's still gonna be sticky. Anyway, right. <coughs> there it goes, one handed. Well, two handed actually. Jeez. Nice um, sleeve.
leave it on there. That's nice fit. Nice fit. No, that's not, that is nice. You have to hand it to Apple. I mean, the packaging is beautiful. I mean, it's uh, there's a bit of an art form, really. So we should have put some more effort into quality control and actually producing products that weren't flawed in some ways. But that's uh, obviously something that upset the rabid fanboys. And uh, almost, uh, I say, the stickers aren't exactly lined up yet. Hold on a second, I'll let you have a grandstand view of the line of the stickers because I'm sure that's important uh, for all these people out there that like stickers to be lined up currently. And I think, yeah, that's pretty, that's pretty bang on. Oh, that's pretty good. That's pretty, pretty close. I mean, there's a little bit of a lip there, but hey, you know what? I can live with it. I'm sure many of us can. I'm sure some people can't, but. Really, those are the ones that need psychological help. Right now, take it back to the old piano. We'll grab the old sticky. Bit of a tricky one this one this time because it actually involves lifting up the iMac and dropping it in exactly the same place. So I'll um, again attempt to give you a view there. Not entirely sure. Well, there it goes. I'll try again and struggle with that because it's a bit of a. It's not overly heavy. But it's a fairly weighty unit to be done one hand delicately. There go, that sticker goes on there. And there we go. That's that's, that's pretty. That's pretty spot on. Uh, it's uh, it's very close. Yeah, it's pretty spot on. Hopefully it's okay. Yeah. There we go. That's a nice, nice, nice product. Nice package up. Take the keyboard off the top there. It's a big deep cavernous box we have here. Very nice. And I might have to just um, hold it there again. Uh, I'm, I'm sure you can guess uh, the procedure next. Um, actually, I'm just going to put a cushion under there because the uh, last thing I want to do is to drop my iPhone. This is bad enough I'm to replace one Apple product, I particularly want to replace two. I did refer to it as an iPod earlier, I do apologise. Um, it actually is an iPhone. <coughs> Not showing off, it's just that's what it is. Oh, Expands what it's a really poor quality video. Uh, right, there we go. Uh, iMac is back in the box and uh, it ticks quite well, doesn't it? That's quite nice. Uh, let's have a look. That's, this bit goes there. No, it doesn't. That bit goes there. Nice design, as I say, it's a beautiful package. Uh, it's a beautiful design by uh, Apple in California. There we go. Goes in there. Nice, nice, nice and snug fit. Um, and yep. Yeah. Just bring these in a little bit. I don't want to damage the polystyrene. Obviously, don't to affect any uh, value of the polystyrene at all. Uh, da -da -da -da. Obviously, it has to be returned in a resellable condition. And uh, there we go, the uh, sides are in, and the box is uh, it's boxed up, and it's looking beautiful, it's upside down again, it's upside down, I can't quite figure it out, oh actually the, the image is the right way up, the actual product is up, upside down, <coughs> there we go, obviously it's uh, raining a little bit, so I'm um, not sure we can see, yeah there's a bit of rain, uh, so obviously what I need to make sure I do is um, fold down the flaps, and uh, to use my knee yeah. and obviously then reseal the box with some tape. Um, other sticky back plastic products are probably available. And there we go!